hey guys welcome to my tutorial series on top java interview question so in this video i am covering string pool so this is the part 2 of my video so last in my last video i have a brief introduction about string pool where using eclipse i have explained all different ways in which we can create the object string object and how it behaves in the string pool so if you have not seen my last video please check that video first so I will provide the link for that video in the description of this video so you can get it from there so in this video I am going to cover the pending advantage of string pools and top interview questions so let's get started okay so let's cover the top interview question related to string pool so as you see on the screen these are the some questions that are generally asked on string pool so if you see question one how many objects will be created for first questions so only one object will be created because both two objects have same value and it's both two objects are literal so only one object will be created so for question two we have three literals but the value is same again only one object will be created for in the string pool so for the question 3 we have three objects three string literals so first two object will have same object s1 and s2 have same object and s3 have different object because the s3 value is different so if you see the question number 4 two object will be created because even all three object s1 s2 th s3 all three objects have same value but s3 is created using new keyword new string so it won't be present into the string pool it is present somewhere into the heap that i explained in my last video so in this case two object will be created so if you see in the last question question fifth here for the s3 string so it is s3 i have wrongly um, entered it s2 so the last string s3 we are using intern method so it means when we use intern method the object will be created into the string pool so it will check if the value of java is already exists so only one object will be created for the fifth question so these are the some of the commonly asked question about the string pool they want to just get to know your knowledge about the string pool okay so let's talk about the some of the commands that we have for the string pool in java so before java 7 string pool are placed in parent space which has a fixed size so it cannot be expanded at runtime and not eligible for garbage collection which cause out of memory errors yeah for any java developer who have faced this problem out of memory problems in java 7 so because string was saved into the sparangian which we cannot extend uh, so runtime it is it can't be garbage collected so there is a limited space so we generally got out of memory uh, exception so from java 7 onwards the java string pool are stored in heap space which is garbage collected by jvm yes so in java 6 we have uh, this double x max param size equal to 1 gb in this way we can actually increase the size of string pool in java 7 we have string table size and there we can increase the size of string pool so these are the some commands those we can use for string pool in java so let's talk about the advantage of string pool so i, I have discussed all the details about the string pool so i think now is the good time to discuss about the advantage so the first advantage is string is immutable in java and immutable objects live in memory for long periods so creation of string object are costly operation yes so immutable objects are thread safe so they live in memory for long term if so many of ob string objects will be created so it will be the vestige of the memory 
and that's why string pool optimize that memory and it won't create new objects for the string literal which have same value so so st definitely string pool decrease the amount of object creations which same memory sp space yeah so that's all about the for the string pool so in my next video i will be covering other important java interview questions so thanks for watching see you in the next video bye bye